Okay, so here's question 17 on the non-calculator paper. Um, a little bit of writing here, a lot of space, but the key thing so far that I've picked up is the star next to the question, which means that there is quality of written communication marks in this question. This question is out of four marks, so at least one of the marks is for the quality of your answer. They want you to set out the answer systematically and to show your workings clearly and to put a sentence at the end of your question describing what you've discovered or describing the answer to the question. So let's read the question. Debbie, Salma and Wendy did a maths test. The total for the maths test was 40 marks. So the maths test was out of 40 marks. Debbie got 16 out of 40. Salma got 35% of the 40 marks. And Wendy got 3 eighths of the 40 marks. Who got the highest? Who got the highest? This question is on fractions and percentages. Right? They want us to show all the workings. So what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to split up base right for the three girls right so I'm going to have Debbie Salma and Wendy And this is about setting out my working so that the examiner could see what I'm doing and it's all clear to them. So Debbie got 16 marks out of 40. So she got 16 altogether. Salma got 35% of 40. So I don't know how many marks that Salma got, but I need to work that out. So like 10% of 40 is 4. That means 10%, you divide by 10 to find 10%. So 10% is 4 marks. And if I sort of work my way up, um, if I double that, 20% of 40 is 8 so together there I've got 30% but I need 35% so if I half the 10 to get my 5% 5% of 40 half of 4 is 2 so add these all up together and that gives me 14 35% of 40 is equal to 14 marks so, so far, Debbie is still in the lead. Debbie got 16 out of 40. Salma got 14 out of 40. Wendy got 3 eighths. 3 eighths of 40. Now, this is a question or a type of question that a lot of people have difficulty with finding a fraction of an amount. 3 eighths, in order to find 1 eighth, I need to divide by, four, divide by 8. So 40 divided by 8 would give me 1 eighth. So 1 eighth of 40 is 40 divided by 8. So if I know that, 1 eighth is therefore going to be 5 marks. But Wendy got 3 eighths. So 3 eighths of 40. If 1 eighth is 5 marks, 3 eighths is going to be 3 lots of 5. 3 lots of 5 is 15 marks. So Wendy got 15, Salma got 14, and Debbie got 16. So the answer to my question, the question is, who got the highest marks? The answer to my question is, Debbie got the highest marks as she got 16 and Salma got 14 and Wendy got 15 marks. I should put 16 marks there. 
Now, there are other ways in which you could have written this. You could have written Debbie got the highest mark as she got more than Salma and Wendy, right? But however you do it, make sure you write a sentence at the end describing the actual answer. This isn't the hardest question. It's presented in a difficult manner, but it isn't the hardest question. If you break it down and do it in a, an ordered and methodical way, you'll get there. Make sure you get these. They're not quite easy marks, but make sure you